Hey guys, Sim is Dim Gaming here, back with a brand new video. This one, obviously, from the title of the video, is talking about Ground Branch and why this is the tactical shooter that I've been waiting for. I played a bunch of Tarkov, about four wipes worth, and while that game is fun, it can get a bit tiring. I was looking for something that was a realistic enough shooter, but you didn't have the risks of just losing everything, and Ground Branch definitely covered that. It's got a lot of little things which I enjoy, such as high and low ready, which basically means you have to have your gun held high or low, otherwise you'll start to lose arm stamina. You don't have an arm stamina bar as such, so you can't tell. It just means if you're walking around with your gun pointing forward for ages and then you engage an enemy, your aim is going to be all over the place. That's just one example of something I really like. Don't get me wrong, Tarkov's realism while brutal, is still quite fun. I like having to load individual bullets into a magazine in a firefight for example, but this just simplifies that. One thing that Ground Branch does do really well, and is probably one of my favourite things, as you can see in the background, you have a wide variety of loadouts you can make, and you can even customise your plate carriers and belt rigs to have any pouches you want. So if you want to run a pistol, for example pistol only, you can have a chest rig full of pistol mag pouches and also a belt rig full of them. Unlike Tarkov and Ready or Not, this has PvE and PvP separately. Ready or Not having just PvE and Tarkov having it mixed into one. You have PvE modes such as Terrorist Hunt and Intel Revival, and then you have PvP modes such as Uplink and Deathmatch. It can be really fun if you get on a good server with a bunch of people, everyone's normally open to just having a laugh. The footage in the background, we all decided to do 1911s only, the entire lobby. None of us knew each other, we just all decided to do it over VoIP, and it was very very fun. Don't get me wrong, this game isn't perfect, the AI aren't as advanced as the AI from Tarkov and Ready or Not. I am going to be comparing these games quite a lot, because they are all in the tactical shooter realm. The AI on Ground Branch is very aimboy. They will know where you are pretty quickly and they'll pretty much just headshot you. That being said, the devs that work on Ground Branch are looking at an AI overhaul as they know that it's an issue. It's not like super off putting, it just can get a bit frustrating. The gunplay itself, we'll touch on that. It's very, very fun. It's nice to kind of get a gun and customise it to how you want and how you think you would use it in the real world or how you use those guns in other games. Personally on most tactical shooter video games I like to run suppressed rifles with some kind of zoomed optic such as a voodoo or something that can go from one to five times. This game fills that itch. Keeping on the subject of weaponry, another thing I forgot to mention earlier is I really like the fact that you can put attachments anywhere on any rail. For example, you can't put optics on side rails, but if you have a full monolithic upper on a Mark 18 for example, you can mount optics or things such as PEC 15s literally anywhere on them. It's great, you can make some really goofy guns, or you can make some really good guns that, that match the kind of eye relief you like. Or if you're running night vision, you can then move your stuff further forward, or further back. Basically, in a nutshell, if you're looking for a tactical shooter that isn't as hardcore as Tarkov but has PvP, Ground Branch is definitely for you. Overall, it's just got a lot of fun things about it which I enjoy and it's kept me coming back. Also not to mention, this game's in pre-alpha. For pre-alpha, yes it has some bugs, but nothing game-breaking. It's really surprising how good and smooth it is. I played a lot of alpha and beta games that have just been terrible and unplayable, but this is not one of them. So basically to end this video, I implore you to even just go and take a look at Ground Branch. It's not a full price game, I think I paid £23 at the time of this video for the game, I don't think it was on sale either, I think it's well worth it, I've definitely already got my money's worth. And they do a lot of updates to this game, it's definitely very well looked after. That's it for the video guys, let me know if you already play Ground Branch and you're enjoying it or if you're not enjoying it as well or if this video is going to make you go and check it out. This is Simmers Dim Gaming and I'll see you in the next one.